go for the launch. Some fungi shoot their spores at a surprisingly high speed to disperse them in some way, but exactly how they achieve this has remained a mystery so far. The spore release is responsible for tens of thousands of fungal species, about one-third of the fungal kingdom, Chuan Hua Chen of Duke University in North Carolina. Biologists have long known that the mechanism involved two drops of water that interacted with the half-egg shape of spores thrown in this way, an elongated drop that forms on its flat side, and a small spherical drop called drop of water. Buller sitting near the rounded spore base. When the droplets melt, the loss of surface area releases some of the energy that maintained the surface tension in the original droplets. This becomes the kinetic energy required to release the spore away from its parent fungus. Chen and his colleagues imitated this process in the laboratory for the first time in order to study the process in detail. The researchers used a 200 micron polystyrene spore in which they slowly built a couple of drops of liquid using an inkjet printer. They kept a high-speed camera trained on her to watch what would happen. As the droplets begin to fuse, the energy is transmitted through the length of the drop that is formed just along the flat side of the spore. 